for those of you I haven't met yet, I'm Giles, and it's my absolute pleasure to be Emily's dad. Uh, and I am so proud to be here with you all today, celebrating the marriage of Emily and Ali, the new Mr. and Mrs. Kissock. Fantastic. Now, I'm sure you'll all agree with me what an amazingly beautiful bride Emily is and what a handsome groom Ali makes as well and, and what a fantastic setting this is for a wedding. Emily and Ali met uh, at Oxford Brookes University where Emily studied psychology and, uh, and Ali studied engineering and I'm, I'm really proud that both of them are following professional careers uh, in those fields today so that's fantastic. And Oxford is such an amazing place and I'm really pleased they met there. Um, often called the city of dreaming spires. Um, it's a beautiful city and, and I'm, I'm pleased that they've got a connection to it. Uh, Emily and Ali both have a love of travel and holidays and, and they've got some very ambitious uh, honeymoon plans which I'm sure will be fantastic. Uh, and they've both taken the opportunity to travel. Uh, and of course, uh, Ali proposed to Emily in the most fantastic setting uh, in Italy leading to us all being here today to celebrate their wedding. So, please raise your glasses to uh, Emily and Ali. May your life together be full of happiness and fun. To the bride and groom, everybody. I, Alistair, take you, Emily, to be my wife, to have and to hold, for better for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish, till death do us apart. I, Emily, take you, Alistair, to be my husband, have and to hold from this day forward, for better for worse, for richer for poorer, to love and to cherish, till death do us part. So in the presence of God and before this congregation, Alistair and Emily have given their consent and made their marriage vows to each other. I therefore proclaim they are husband and wife. <laughs> So uh, we wanted to start by sharing a bit about how we met. Um, now we both have very different recollections of the first time we met and uh, one of us can definitely uh, remember a little bit clearer than the other, which has caused uh, a few disagreements over the years. Uh, but what we can both agree on is that it all started in a student night in Oxford called Fuzzy Ducks. <laughs> 
So, uh, after meeting Emin Fuzzies, I, I actually had no idea who she was at the first time. And so, we actually have two of our friends here tonight, uh, Lucy and Callum, who we, uh, we have to thank for reintroducing us uh, when, we were, when we were sober. So, uh, cheers to Lucy and Callum. <laughs> okay, uh, we want to thank each and every one of you for coming today uh, and for making such an effort to celebrate our wedding with us. So, whilst we're thankful for all of you being here today, we also wanted to acknowledge those that uh, are sadly absent as well. There's a, a, a very big hole you know, left, not just here today, but um, each and every day with my dad not being here. Um, and we have absolutely no doubt that he would have been making best friends with all of you tonight. You know, he'd been you know, sharing a glass of red, having a good chat, getting to know you all. And throughout the whole two years since dad passed, the only reason I've kept my head just above the water is because of this incredibly special person standing right next to me. So um, you, you know, you, you're my absolute rock and um, I'd be completely lost without you. So, <laughs> I've, I've always said to you that I knew you were the one uh, ever since that night in Fuzzies. Um, <laughs> when you asked how I knew, I've always just said, you know, it, it's strong feeling with, within me, which I can't fully explain. Um, but I'll give it a bit of a go. Um, to explaining it and it's a similar feeling that I'm sure I've no doubt that all of you have had the first time you met Em as well. Uh, you, you're just the most incredible person uh, who has a natural gift for lighting up you know the room and you'll bring a smile on anyone's face. You're the most selfless person who will always put others first no matter what and you're the most fiercely loyal person as well you know you defend your friends and family to the end and we all know that and it's just incredible. They're just a couple of the qualities that, that make you so 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 special and you know help a little bit to explain that feeling that I've had and I'm sure all of us have had. You know your sheer amazingness always just shines through um, and I can see it that day, I can see it today, I've seen it every day in between and um, I just want to say I love you so much and I can't wait to uh, create many more happy memories in the future together. So, if you raise your glass for a final toast to my beautiful, amazing wife. <laughs>